taking uh, comments and questions uh, on Ustream. Uh, Rich Bake, what have you got? All right, here we got a questioner who says, does the car basically tell you what to do to stay in electric mode? It doesn't tell you what to do, but what it does is it gives you the information so you can make the decision. So for instance, if you step on the accelerator pedal real hard, you'll see a jump out of the EV mode and you'll know, oh wow, that was really fast. I got out of the electric mode quicker than I wanted to. Or you'll see a leaf disappear and you'll say, hmm. Or you'll see the fuel economy, instantaneous fuel economy say, wow, I'm getting low fuel economy. So again, that's giving you the information to make the decision and coaching you to say, okay, drive a little more fuel efficient. This is an uh, impressive looking LCD uh, monitor actually on each side of an analog speedometer, is that right? That's correct. You've got two 4.2 inch LCD screens and in fact they're similar to the ones that are used by the PlayStation and it has that level of capability and color. So these are very, very vivid, very durable. Uh, they've been in industry for a long Was time. Was there a debate as you were uh, developing this about distraction for the driver? Not at all. As I said earlier, we uh, we took a lot of customer input. We took input not only from Ford customers, but external customers as well, and allowed them to give us input on what they wanted to see, how they wanted to see it, and then we developed something. And uh, we put it in this, what we call a vertex simulator. So think of that as a 360 degree dome, literally, with a car inside of it, and it simulates you driving. So it looks like you're driving along. And then we took the feedback. I said, mm, you guys did it a little too engineering-wise. So we did a little geeky. We're engineers. We understand that. <laughs> so we toned it down, and we actually put the information that, that they wanted. And we've got nothing but positive, positive results.